our mission is to help you learn the English language. We have created easy to follow free educational materials for those seeking knowledge of English. Hello, madam. What can we do for you today? Hi, I've been sent over from Turner Interiors. They said I need to collect some sort of L, C. Do you have it? I certainly do. Here it is. An export L, C from Tokyo. It should be from Sayuri Beds. Is that right? Yes, it is. Sayuri Beds, Tokyo, Japan. That's what I want. Do you need me to sign anything? Or fill in some forms? Just sign right here, please. That's everything you need to do. Perfect. Thank you. Goodbye. Could you do something to advance your time of shipment? Well, our manufacturers are fully committed at the moment. I'm afraid it's very difficult to improve any further on the time. I hope you'll try to convince them to step up production. We check their production schedule against our orders almost every day. As new orders keep coming in, they are working three shifts to step up production. I'm sorry, but we simply cannot commit ourselves beyond what the production schedule can fulfill. Well, in that case, there is nothing more to be said. What's your last word as to the date then? I said by the middle of October. This is the best we can promise. All right, I'll take you at your word. May I suggest that you put down in the contract shipment on October 15th or earlier? Our letter of credit will be opened early September. Good. Let's call it a deal. We'll do our best to advance the shipment to September. The chances are that some of the other orders may be cancelled. But of course you cannot count on that. In any case, we'll let you know by email. That's very considerate of you. And now, shall we discuss the insurance terms? We generally insure WP, WP, A, on a CIF offer. Special risks, such as 10, theft, pilferage and non-delivery, leakage, breakage, oil, freshwater, etc. can also be covered upon request. I suppose the additional premium for the special coverage is for the buyer's account. Quite right. According to the usual practice in international trade, special risks are not covered unless the buyer asks for them. Then what about SICC, strikes, riots and civil commotions? Can we request you to cover this for our imports? Yes, we accept it now, after it has been suspended for many years. However, if you want to have it covered for your imports at your end, you may arrange the insurance as you like. Then please cover WPA and tend for this transaction. All right. I'll adjust the price accordingly. How much can I change $100 for? What kind of currency do you want? How much will it be in Chinese currency? That's 680 yuan. The consignments of chemical instruments have just reached us. We have to lodge a claim against you for inferior quality I am afraid. Is there anything wrong? We bought 1,000 sets of chemical instruments from you, but there are 40 not up to the standard. It's hard for us to believe it. Our instruments have been the best quality for years. Have you any reliable evidence? Here is the survey report from a well-known public surveyor in London. You may inspect the defective instruments personally. Well, according to the contract, 
we are responsible for repairing or replacing those defective instruments. We'll send our technicians to repair them. 40 faulty instruments means that 4% are not up to the standard. You should compensate us for 4% of the total account on the contract, as well as for the inspection fee. I am sorry about the quality problem, but I propose we compensate you for 3% of the total value apart from the inspection fee. All right. In that case we are still willing to do business with you. Mr. Moon, how good to see you again. Hello. Miao Ping, I'm here to chat with you about corporate agreement savings. What can you tell me? Well, corporate agreement savings will be based on the agreement deposit contract signed by the customer and the bank together. So, this contract decides the terms in the line of basic deposit withheld while settling the account. So, if we look within the line of basic deposit, the interest should be counted at the rate of current deposit on the day of settlement or withdrawal. What if I exceed? If it goes beyond the basic deposit, the agreement will be settled at the rate agreement savings which has been determined by the People's Bank of China on the day you wish to settle or withdraw. Right, I see. It all sounds pretty complicated to me. I think I'm going to need some more time to think about this and make a decision as to what I want to do. Hi. I was wondering how I'd go about getting a credit card. Certainly, sir. You do have a current account with us, right? Oh, no. I'm afraid I don't. Is that necessary? Yes, sir. In order to get a credit card with us, you'll need to open a current account here. Could you please fill out this form with your relevant details? That's done. Do you need to see any credentials? Yes. A passport will be fine. I don't have my passport on me at the moment. I'll just pop back to my office and pick it up. That's fine, sir. We'll see you again a little later. I want to open a saving account, sir. What's the proper procedure? First. You fill out the application form and then we'll issue you a passbook. Is there any minimum for the first deposit? No. Even a dollar is all right. Here's your passbook. Sir. Just sign your name on it. What is the annual interest rate? It varies from time to time. At present it is 6%. By the way. Can I open a checking account too? By all means. But you have to deposit enough money before you can write out your checks. I have to use the ATM. Is there a problem? I don't know how to use it. What are you talking about? I have never used an ATM before. I can show you how to use it. How do I use it? You need to push your card into the machine. What's next? Enter your PIN. What else do I have to do? Every option you can choose will appear on the screen. That's about it. How are you doing today? Very well. Thank you. What can I help you with? Do I have any fees to pay? As a matter of fact, you do. How much? You owe $235.13. That's unbelievable. Will you be paying some of that off today? I want to pay all of it off today. How will you be paying? I'll be paying with cash.
Good morning. What can I do for you? I want to buy a car to facilitate my life. But I don't have enough money. Could you supply a loan to me? Oh, I see. Would you mind telling me your monthly salary? Sure. 7,000 yuan per month. Okay. We can supply you a loan. How much do you want a loan? 200,000 yuan. By the way, what about the interest rate? It's only 4.5% for one year loan. Do you want to apply now? Yes, I think so. Okay, please fill out this loan application. All right, thank you. My pleasure. Good morning. Welcome to Bank of the USA. How may I help you today? Hi. I need to transfer some money to another account. It's urgent. Okay. Have you made a wire transfer at our bank before? No. I've never made a transfer before. It's all right. I will take you through the procedure. Are you transferring funds to a company or an individual account? A company account. I need to pay a bill. Okay. I'll need the name of the company and their bank routing number as well as their bank's address and phone number. I have all the information in this folder. Well, you've come prepared. You have all the necessary materials so we can go ahead and make the transfer right now. It's a simple transaction, and we can process it today. Oh. That's such a relief. I didn't want the payment to be overdue. Thank you so much. It's my pleasure. Good morning, sir. Can I help you? Good morning. I'd like to cash this check. Yes, sir. Can you show you identity? What about the driving license? Don't you have any other identification? I am sorry. I only have my driving license with me. Okay. Would you please sign your name on the back of the check? Thank you. Here you are. How do you want your money? Would you give me some in twenties and tens? All right. Please wait for a moment. Good morning, madam. Is everything okay? Is there something I can assist you with? Thank you. Yes. I'm not sure how to use this ATM. I usually go to a clerk and use my bank book. But today, I thought I'd try something new. I want to take some money out. Welcome to the electronic age. I can run you through it. It's what I'm here for. Thanks so much. Right. I've put my card in. What now? Just look at the screen here. It'll give you prompts, you see? Now you need to enter your PIN number, then press enter to confirm it. Then it'll give me my money? Not right away. You need to decide what it is you want to do. The next thing is to select the service. Here we are, withdrawal. So I just press here? Yes. Then enter the amount you want. Oh, as simple as that. I shall never wait for a real person again. These machines are wonderful. Would you like to know about benefits and so forth? Please. Everyone enjoys hearing the benefits of something. With this agreement we can bring over you many benefits. For example, head offices of your group companies can get really prompt integrated fund transfers and centralized allocations. This helps internal supervision and admin run smoothly. That is wonderful. We've been having serious problems in that area. Our internal accounts seem so messy at the moment. Nothing is running smoothly and it's costing us time and money. Hopefully signing up for this network settlement service will solve all of that.
If you are sure, we can go ahead now, sir. How does 10 a.m. tomorrow sound, to get all of the paperwork out of the way? I'm the mortgage advisor at this branch. You wanted a chat about housing loans? Yes, I've found a wonderful property I wish to buy. Unfortunately, I just don't have access to the cash. I see. It's a problem most of us face. May I ask what the purchase price is? It's 600,000 rib. But I've already put down 200,000 rib, which is my absolute limit. So I'm looking for a loan of 400,000 rib. So, you've already made a large initial deposit? That is good news. Okay, let's have a look at your credit details and get this started. I already have an account with you, so it should be pretty straightforward. That is good. It should speed things up nicely. Welcome to Lincoln Bank. What can we do for you today? Hello. I called earlier in the week and spoke to someone in the personal loans department about an overseas study loan. She said to come in as soon as I had the chance, as this must be done in person. I'd like to apply today. Okay. That's absolutely fine. I will need to see some credentials before we can get started. Do you have the notification of admission letter from your university, your passport and your visa with you? Yes, yes. It's all here. There you go. I'm not sure if I need any other proof or guarantee to get this loan, do I? You do, I'm afraid. There are three ways to do this. You can choose, mortgage, pledge or guarantee mode. Yes. I read about all of these in the brochure and decided which would be more suitable for me. I'd like to go for the guarantee mode, please. Right. That's no problem. I see you are already well informed. If you choose that one, you can borrow up to 70% of the total tuition and miscellaneous fees. Okay. That's perfect. 70% is excellent. It'll be a big help. Thanks. Good morning, madam. What can I do for you today? Hello. I hope you can help me. I'm a little worried about my new card. What seems to be the problem? I received my new card this morning, but I'm unable to use it. Oh? You mean, the ATM machine has eaten it? No, it's right here, see? The ATM will not accept it. You said you received your card this morning, am I right? Yes, I was told it would be activated and ready to use right away. So, what's gone wrong? Did you receive your PIN number yet, madam? You see, unless you have your new PIN number, to match your new card, you cannot use it. We usually send that separately, around one day after the card, for security reasons. Well, that explains it. I've been using my old PIN number. Thanks for explaining everything to me. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to become a part of our growing YouTube community and to learn English effectively.